Hello everyone, it's Laura here. I'm going to show you some things I've been picking up from some different websites here in Australia. I'm going to show you some things that I've picked up from two different websites. And the first website is a site that sells a lot of grocery items and it's all non-perishables. And it's things that you use at home, um, cleaning products, beauty, health, baby items, lots of different things. And uh, usually on a Friday they have some free items up. and um, so I like to quickly get all the free things and then pick up um, some things I need at home and some things I can use to resell on eBay. And one of the free things I did get was the Bratz birthday plastic table cover with the napkins. And I've got that up on eBay at the moment. Because I've been finding um, birthday things like this are selling very really well. And on that website I've got these Transformer birthday banners. I got a couple of these for free and then over the time I've been on there a couple of them for free and I've been paying a dollar each and I'm selling them for seven dollars each and I've sold quite a few of them. It's easy, quick to post and um, yeah I really, it's a good little profit. Not much but it adds up. Um, this isn't from that website. This I got at an op shop. 50 cents a packet. Um, just invitations, bridal shower, baby shower, and they've been selling quite well too. Now back to that website, I have been getting into some beauty, beauty creams and gels. This is anti-cellulite, and these are anti-aging peel. This one's 40 something retail, I paid 350 I paid around the same price for this one, and I think it's 39 or something in the shops. I've been selling the, this one for $13 a piece and this one for $15 a piece. And I did have another, the same brand but a different um, cream. It was for your eyes. And I had quite a few of them. I must have been about 12 or 14 bottles of it. And this sold so quickly for me. It was a great profit. I ended up making like a $160 profit on just those eye cream pens. Um, they were in the shape of a pen and it helps with crow's feet or something like that and they sold very quickly for me. Some people were buying three and four bottles of it for me. Um, I got this Transformer birthday kit. That was from the same website. I'm selling these for $13 each and I paid $2 for them. And I've got seven left. So the website has a lot of different things. Like it's got this kids bakeware and mini, it's a mini kit for them. Paid $2.50. I was selling them for $15. Sold a couple for $15 and then they're just not selling now. So I've dropped it down to $10 just to quickly get rid of them. And at the back there, that's just the Beatles tea towels, which I've shown in a previous video. And they're not from that website. I've just run out of room of where to stock things, store things, sorry. So they ended up in this box. So that's one website. Another website is a website that has different sales that start every single day and the sales can have 80-90% off it can be high-end designer items sometimes they've got Gucci handbags, Fendi handbags sometimes it's just Australian designers um, lots of different things it's everything you can ever think of that's on that website and one of the sales had all these puppets and the puppets were retailed for $52.95 and they were all reduced down to $22 each. And there were lots of different designs of the puppets. But the nurse wasn't $22. The nurse was at $2 each. And I think someone made a mistake when they were entering the price. Because all the other puppets had $22 price tag on them. And these were $2. So I quickly grabbed 10 of them. And I've got them up on eBay at $20 each. And I've never sold puppets before. I just thought at that price... I can't pass that up and the quality of them like if you take the shoe off the nurse she's got her toes they're all individually sewn she's got underwear on she's got her hair and all the clothing can come off and you can redress them up and it's the quality is excellent um, something else that I got from that website were these shoes so these are like brogues with a high heel I had uh, three pairs of them, I've sold one. I got these other shoes down the bottom here, they're witchery, they retail for 200 I paid $10 for them. 
after all weather. Big wooden platform. I've already sold a pair and um, I paid $10 for them and I sold it for $60. I'd buy it now plus postage because postage is $15 for these shoes. So um, I'm hoping I can get rid of the other pair. Maybe when the weather's a bit cooler. It is incredibly hot here this morning and it's not even 9 o'clock in the morning so I'm going to dread, dread in to think what it's going to be like at lunchtime. Um, something else from that website. I got 69 pairs of glasses and these were all a dollar each. So there's many different designs. I'm selling them for $13 a pair. Is it $13 or $12 a pair on eBay? Um, and they've been selling quite well. Since I've listed them a couple weeks ago, I've already sold 10 pairs. So, um, yeah, really happy with that. I've made my money back already, so the rest of them are just profit. These are Group Lots of Heart Sunglasses. Um, that's not from that website, that's from something else, sorry. That's from DHgate. So, I sell them on eBay as well. Now, this... Sorry. This website... Sorry about this video being so... Um, all over the place. I've got too much stock and I haven't got enough good storage to place it all. So I'll quickly show you some more things that I've picked up from this website. I've got these Ben Sherman hats. I've got three of them. Uh, $5 each. I've got 30 of these belts in total. The leather with studs. They were a dollar each. I've got lots of different colours, lots of different sizes. Just a pair of women's shorts. They're meant to be, I think they were $120. I paid five. I've already sold a pair of the denims um, for $20, so it's a quick, easy 15 profit. These swimming shorts for boys with the caps as well. They're made in France. They were a dollar each. So I've got a big pile of them. There's more of the belts. Um, something else I got for $5 was a silk bow tie in its box. I sold one already for $20. I've got one left. Oh, this is a lovely evening bag. I'm not going to take it out because it's all wrapped up originally. Uh, it's a gold sequin bag. It's meant to be $60 here. I paid $8 for it on the website and I've already sold one of them. And I've only got one left as well. So as you can see, there's just so much, so much stuff here. It's not funny. Um, I got this one yesterday in the mail. I got eight of them. It's Victoria's Secret garter belts. I paid four each, and I've put them up to twenty dollars each. Um, there's only two other sellers in Australia who have Victoria's Secret garter belts, so I'm hoping they sell more belts. Now, there's some of the stuff in here I can't even remember what I've actually ordered. So these are leather vests. So they're all leather vests. There's some mesh detailing on the side. I paid five each. And I've sold one for 25 already. And I bought six in total. So there's five left to go. So I'll pop that out the way. Um, and here is just a handbag. Paid five, putting up for twenty. And in here, there's just lots of different clothing. There's designer, Australian designer dress. And I bought these dresses for five each. This one is actually free because they sent me the wrong one, so they credited my account. I'm putting them up for twenty a piece. Um, it's a silver skirt. It's a bit hard to see. I can't really take everything out. These little skirts here I got on the website for a dollar each. They're not anything major. Just black stud detailing. Uh, gold stud detailing, sorry. Black skirts. They're a dollar each. 
I'm just trying to get rid of them now at $7 each. More of those vests. And I'm pretty sure I have shown these costumes before that are down the bottom. The scarecrow, the scarecrow costume. I paid $2 each for these. And Frankenstein costumes. I'm pretty sure I've already shown them on YouTube before. That's just all costumes on the bottom. Now, also in here, paid two dollars each for all these um, case logic. That's a car door. That's a car door and store organizer. You know, MP3 player holders. Some of these in the shop are twenty dollars each. Paid two dollars. So I'm, I've popped all these up on eBay as well. And I actually sold the armband one already. You know, the photo bags, camera holders. Because if you make a sale on this web, if you buy something on this website, um, you pay the first postage for the first sale. And then when you go and buy other stuff, the postage is all free. So that's why that day I probably had like $10 sitting in PayPal and I had free postage, so I bought a few different items. Now, that's some stuff from that website there, and I'll show you the other things as well. So, please just excuse the mess, because this is where I store everything that's been listed on eBay. So you can see there's a lot of different things here. <coughs> and from that website as well, you can see I've got some jewelry items. This necklace is supposed to be a hundred and something dollars. I paid twelve. This lovely necklace here. If I can get it out of the bubble wrap for you. This was supposed to I don't understand how it could be this, but it was supposed to be four hundred, I think, or three eighty nine. Three hundred and eighty nine dollars. I paid fifty dollars for it. Because I saw people in Australia selling them for a hundred and $29.95 so I tried my luck with it and I don't normally spend that much money on one item but um, I'm hoping it sells. I got all these thermal um, shirts and trousers for kids and they were a dollar each so as you can see I've got quite a few there um, and as you can see I've got a lot more different types of sunglasses there's Sports girl sunglasses. I've got some witchery ones here. Um, I've got a Pandora bracelet that I found in a scrap bag of jewelry at the op shop, and I already had the box, so I just popped, popped that bracelet into the box. From the same website, I got a Kenneth J. Lane ring, all stamped. Um, paid, I think it was ten for that. I popped it up for thirty dollars. So as you can see, each different slot is a different company of sunglasses that I know where they are and I can quickly grab them to wrap them. Um, there's my trusty wigs. All my different coloured wigs that I sell. They sell great for me. Now some of the things on that website, we'll get back to that. Zara dresses. $2 each. Been selling them for $13 a piece. I had, two, I had three blacks. I had two reds, I haven't sold a red yet. I had other Zara dresses that I've completely sold out. Now I've got all these Man United shirts as well with the tags, authentic merchandise. Um, I've been giving them a quick press before I do post them because they're very wrinkled. I paid $4 each. So lots of different designs on the front. You know, there's the reds go marching up, up, up. Lots of different sizes. Um, the same website, I've got these Zara skirts. They haven't sold yet. They were $2 each. Um, so the website's great to find bulk of the same items as well. So it's a website that has lots of different sales every day. Um, it's lots of designer items. Lots of just uh, strain designers and things like that. And the sale starts at a certain time every day. And first in, first gets. Uh, well, first in, first 
buys it. So um, if you get in there quick enough, you can pick up some really good bargains. Sometimes it sells out within the minute and you've just lost lost your chance to get it. But it's a good bit of fun to try and get the different bargains and they've been selling very well for me. The website is an Australian website. Um, so if anyone wants to know what it is, just PM me to get it. Um, I do have lots of hassles with receiving the correct items from this website. I have complained quite a bit to them. Um, and last year, a lot of my orders came and they were damaged, stained. Um, they weren't the right item. And I ended up sending that many emails to them. I received about just over $100 of credit because they made so many mistakes last year. But when you do get items like this and they sell well for you and you get bargain things for a dollar, two dollars, you know, it's hard to resist the temptation to go back and try your luck and get more. Um, yeah, so I hope this showed you a bit of what I have been buying in bulk that is brand new. Um, I'm sure there's other things here. There's my big, my big roll of bubble wrap nearly half my height. I'm six foot so it's not quite up to me yet but that's my bubble wrap. I go through one of them every couple of months with my jewellery and different things. Um, there's the other Zara dress. The last one sold last night so that one's gone and that's from that website as well. Um, yeah so I hope it was a bit informative and to show you the stuff that I have been buying in bulk and um, so if you want to know the websites and you're in Australia, just PM me. I just don't want to really say them on the on the YouTube. And um, hope everyone's finding some good finds and good sales on eBay. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Bye.